Something as simple as a teddy bear can have a big impact on a child going through trauma. That's why a Colorado teenager and his classmates are coming together to help young victims of crime. The Thornton Police Department will handle the deliveries. CBS 4's Jeff Todd live in Thornton tonight. And Jeff, this isn't all those classmates are doing either. Jim, in two years, the rules for graduating high school in Colorado are changing. Some students will try and achieve a score on a test, but for some of those kids who learn in a different way, they're allowed to do a capstone project. And as we saw today, helping out the community is just fine for students like Blake. It was a really good experience that I had because I've, I've never felt that kind of thing before. It's been an eventful semester for Blake Ald and his teammates. They've worked on projects, making Easter wreaths for seniors, helping families in need, and getting dozens of stuffed animals donated. Two big trash bags, like the big black ones, the latest belief bags. They'll be used by the Thornton Police Victim Services. We feel good about ourselves. We feel good that we're doing something for something for the community, you know. These capstone projects have helped Blake thrive. I think it helps me prepare for life. He's needed alternative learning because he struggles with bipolar disorder and ADHD. Blake's mom has seen him blossom. In responsibility, in maturity, in time management, in communication, uh, all of those things, it has been noticeable. She was so proud she posted to Facebook about the donation drive, and that's when she started hearing from others who receive stuffed animals like this during a traumatic event. They were meaningful in their life. To know that Blake and this wonderful group of kids are supporting that and making meaningful differences, I just think is amazing and beautiful. And we as his parents just could not be more proud. Well, some kids will still opt for that standardized test score in order to meet the graduation requirement. Blake told us that he just appreciates the opportunity to do good in the community. <laughs> Jim, back to you. Oh, Jeff, what a treat to meet Blake. Delightful young guy. Thanks very much.